I've always been fascinated by mirrors. Not the reflections themselves, but the idea that another universe could exist beyond the glass. I was about to learn how wrong I was. I found an antique mirror at a garage sale, a beautiful, ornate thing that drew me in with a magnetic pull. I hung it in my bedroom, excited to have such a lovely piece. But that night, I started having nightmares. In the dreams, I was trapped in a mirror, watching my own life unfold as a silent observer. I saw myself doing things I didn't remember, things I would never do. It was as if my reflection had a life of its own, and it was slowly taking over mine. I was losing time, waking up in places I didn't remember going to, finding objects in my home I'd never seen before. Growing desperate, I decided to cover the mirror. But when I tried to hang a cloth over it, my reflection didn't mimic me. It just stood there, smiling. I watched in horror as its hand reached out from the glass, pushing against the barrier between us. I ran out of the room, barricading the door behind me. But I could still hear it moving inside, scratching at the walls, trying to get out. Now, I am trapped in my own home. I can't go back into my bedroom, but I can't leave either. What if it gets out while I'm gone? I'm writing this as a warning, don't let your fascination overtake your caution. Don't let it out. Mirrors aren't gateways to other universes. They're prisons for what's inside.